The Bionicle Multiverse, a piece of work forged by the fans to tell their own stories and tales with a variety of interesting pieces of work to boot, and with BioTube's 10th anniversary coming up, I figured it'd be a fun way to celebrate this anniversary by making a collaboration of animated projects. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, you can be part of the show. You can get your channel featured on BioTube, even though you're free to join us and bring your own brand of Bionicle to the table, in the, Bio in the BioTube 10th Anniversary Project, Portals. This is a story of a character who basically takes a journey through the various universes of BioTube as a whole to try and basically save his friend. And let's just say this collaboration is open to the community as a whole. And with that... Let's just say that you should probably go watch the Doors collaboration from my Hyun's Dojo first before joining this collaboration to get a good idea about what you'll be doing. The link to that video will be in the description. Alright, so let's go ahead and go over the rules really quickly. Rule 1. You have to have your footage between 10 to 20 seconds. This way you can effectively show your realm and whatever is going on in it, and then promptly leave. If it's over, if it's over 20 seconds, it'll either be trimmed or cut. Chances are, it'll be cut. Rule 2. The footage must feature a version of the Akaima Mock. This is because this is part of the Constorm lore, and frankly, uh, self mocks going in its place just don't resonate well with the environment. Rule 3. You can do whatever you want just as long as it's YouTube appropriate, meaning you could have a Kaima walk in, get in a fight with somebody, high-five somebody, give them a handshake, or just straight up say, hey, where am I? And then walk out. Rule 4. No background music. This is because of the risk of getting hit by copyright, and frankly, this seems to happen pretty often. Rule 5. You are responsible for any special effects from your side of the project, meaning if you have green screen, you have to do it yourself. We can't do it for you. And if you have blast effects, and you, do, er, and you say you run out of time, well, you may be asked to reshoot. But, yeah. Simply put, you're responsible for any special effects you use on your part of the project. Rule 6. Well, I guess this isn't, isn't a rule, this is more of a due date announcement. But, the final footage due date is September 25th. Meaning, you have plenty of time, you have the entire summer to come up with 20 seconds of how to show off your realm in the most effective way you can think of. And finally, Rule 7. You must submit your entry to contactanimation44 at gmail.com, email will be in the description, with your channel name, channel link, and channel logo. Rules will also be in the description. And finally, a video showing how to build the Akaima Mock will be released shortly. Although it's very simple to build, and you are welcome to customize the build according to your environment, after all, Chances are you're not going to have some of the parts that are on this build, just because some of them are actually pretty old. And as long as it remains in the core design, you should have no issues. However, like I said, if you have your self mock walking in, interacting and out, that'll be cut. As long as you have the mock walking in, interacting and out, that's that works. We may even have we may even show an example. Finally, that's pretty much that. We hope to at least get 10 people on this project. I know, it's not much, but frankly, we've already got 5 people who are willing. Then again, I went to them, they didn't come to me. So, let's just say, I'd love to have more than 10 people on this, just to see how this would all play out. But, we hope... You have fun with this little project, and we look forward to seeing your finished work. Thank you all for listening, and we hope to see something great from you.